Candidates' real estate becoming a real issue. The question to John McCain has sparked the latest campaign trail fire. Here now, seen as Ed Henry. Well, thank you for bringing that. John McCain has been on a roll because of his sudden ability to stay on message and deliver a jab. I am not questioning his patriotism. I am questioning his judgment. But just as McCain gets some downtime on the eve of the Democratic convention, he veers dramatically off message again. How many houses do you and Mrs. McCain have? I think uh, I'll, I'll have my staff get to you. I'll okay. tell you about it. Hey, some of them have any of them for their. Uh, I'll have them get to you. The McCain camp insists the senator knows the answer. The couple has four homes, their ranch near Sedona, and condos in Arizona, California, and Virginia. But the Obama camp notes the total is higher if you include the couple's investment properties. I suppose if you got seven, maybe eight houses, the economy looks fundamentally sound to you. Manna from heaven for Obama, whose party is getting nervous that yet another Democratic candidate has been getting soft amid Republican attacks. Obama has also been called an elitist, so he's pouncing on the chance to put that label back on McCain. But if you're like me and you got one house, or you were like the millions of people who are struggling right now to keep up with their mortgage so they don't lose their home, you might have a different perspective. This could be just another campaign blip, or it could get politically explosive for McCain, especially since Obama also cites McCain's offhand comment that you're rich if you have $5 million. McCain says he was just joking, but Obama says it shows he's out of touch. But Obama's own attack comes with some risk, as the McCain camp fired back by invoking his ties to Tony Resco, who was convicted on federal bribery and fraud charges. McCain spokesman Brian Rogers said of Obama, does a guy who made more than $4 million last year, just got back from vacation on a private beach in Hawaii, and bought his own million-dollar mansion with the help of a convicted felon, really want to get into a debate about houses? A classic counterpunch directed at Obama, and now it's his turn to reassure his side he's ready to respond. Ed Henry, CNN, Washington.